Hi, Concord here. So we've decided to upgrade our stylus, but before I keep going on, I just want to quickly get this out. I just want to let you know of the following. My room Q6 and Hi-Fi equipment will be different to yours, so the sound will differ, and sound is a subjective and a personal experience. So we've been using the Autophon Bronze cartridge for some time, and we've been really happy with it over the last two years. It's had some really decent use. So we've decided to try another stylus and we've stayed with the Autophon 2M series and the great thing about the Autophon 2M series is that you can just upgrade or level up by just replacing the stylus depending on which model you have. So how it works is if you have the 2M red in the series you can replace the stylus or upgrade to the 2M blue without having to change the whole cart. Now after the blue comes the bronze, and after the bronze comes the black. Now if you're going to go to the bronze after having the blue or the red, as I mentioned, this will require an entirely new cartridge. You cannot put the bronze stylus onto the 2M red or blue cart. So if you do go to the bronze, you have two upgrade options. You can replace the stylus with the 2M black or the 2M LVB250 stylus. Now we're replacing the stylus uh, with from bronze to the 2M LVB250 stylus. Now replacing the stylus is quite simple as you can see here in this video. I'm just taking the blue off and it just slides off. Now I've done this with my bronze to the as I mentioned to the LVB250 stylus and also measured it as well as the downforce was less than the bronze or the blue it actually was 1.60 i think in this video it's 1.55 so i eventually got to one point or close to 1.6 or maybe 1.61 i can't exactly remember um and if you're wondering about that tone arm measuring tool i got that from amazon and I believe this is actually the one I got. Now I'm not promoting this brand, um, but if you if you ever want to get one, um, I find it a really good little tool to have. I think Project Audio have their own version. So does Riga. So does Audifon. So have a look on the internet. But I just find it a really neat little tool to have. So the 2M LVB 250 stylus. My thoughts on the LVB. I have noticed more detail from the bronze. I also think it's got a cleaner sound to it. However, my thoughts are I'm not getting as much out of this stylus as I think I could be. I think the lim level, uh, I think the limitations is in my phono preamp. Now, why I'm saying that is I actually tried out a three thousand or maybe it was four thousand dollar phono preamp and that was with the bronze and i got a lot more sound out of out of the bronze i got a lot more so i think the lvb has a lot more sound to give me but i think i've the limitations in my phono preamp now don't get me wrong I've had a other I'm not trying to contradict myself I know I've got other videos where I review the Project Audio Tube Box S2 and I love it it's a great little phono preamp but I think I've reached as much sound as it's going to give me so I'm waiting for uh, Prima Luna to release their phono preamp I believe they've got one in the works I, I'm really keen to see what they bring out um, so I'm going to hold on to this Vino, the Project Audio S2. That's my next uh, upgrade, the Phono preamp. But I'm in no rush. I'll stick with this for a little bit more. But that's the thing with some of your hi-fi equipment. Sometimes the limitation can be in your components. Well, I know that for me. It'd be like buying a really nice car and a sports car and you don't put very good rims or tires on it. And then you're wondering why it's not cornering very well or, you, you know, you feel like you gonna um maybe that's a bad analogy but that's how i kind of look out of it you know you could have really nice and things on your car and then the limitation is here i, I noticed that with my four-wheel drive actually when i 
uh, changed the exhaust and put a snorkel on it, the engine just breathed and I was actually getting more out of the engine. And I was like, oh wow, just a little upgrade, I can now can get more. And it's similar to your hi-fi equipment. So if, if everything else around it is so much better and then you, it can, yeah, you can reach limitations, um, the limitation in that product. Anyway, I could be wrong. Happy hi fi is there to be enjoyed. I just enjoy hi fi. And if you're going to leave a comment, yeah, leave a comment and please leave it constructive and friendly. I'm just someone who enjoys hi fi. I like to have a bit of a discussion about it and enjoy it. And if you like this video, leave a like. And if you don't, well, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time.